Let's go on with our callers. Tom Bearden is on the line from Huntsville, Alabama with us. And uh, we have Carl wanting to know about the scale waves. Carl? Tom? Uh, yes, Carl. I can, can barely hear you, but I'll go on. Uh, I've read considerable about uh, Nikola Tesla in the past few years. And uh, one of the measurements that he made was in a storm, uh, the wave action, the electric wave action that went around the Earth. And he, he measured the amount of time and everything. And uh, what I wanted to know was, uh, is this in the same basic uh, uh, ELF type of frequency ranges? Uh, no, Carl, it's not in the ELF, but uh, the, the point you bring up is very interesting. Storms do produce scalar waves. And uh, as a matter of fact, one of the things that produces ball lightning, uh, the mysterious phenomena that used to be a fraud and now is accepted and known to be real, uh, ball lightning, for example, is often produced because a cloud in the region and the ground or two clouds form a scalar interferometer, projecting scalar waves which, because of their randomness, form a sort of a circle. And you get a glowing ball of energy where the energy bottle is. And that's usually what produces uh, the ball lightning from the clouds. Now, what Tesla detected in the Colorado Springs and, and uh, caused a great deal of excitement when he realized what it was, he detected the waves from the storm, even though it was very far away. And he realized that what he was looking at was something extremely unusual. Uh, with his very agile mind, he immediately went from that uh, on into the things where he demonstrated from Colorado Springs the fact that he could transmit uh, a wave around the Earth and form a standing wave. If he had succeeded in finishing the tower that he was building on Long Island, Wardenclyffe, Cliff, he would have given the world free energy with such a standing wave. Huh. However, Wall Street did not like the idea. Uh, that which figured, is normal. <laughs> they figured energy was something to sell and something to tax. And uh, so that ended that. All right, I have two things I would like to find. One, one there in the last old...